Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Alicia here and today I'm coming to you guys with a fragrance collection. Right, if you know me, you know I love my smell goods and I have all these little fuzzies in my hair. I don't know why, but I'm rocking the full locks. This is the look for today. And yeah, if you know me, you know I love my fragrances. So that's one thing about me. I love my fragrances, okay? And I love to smell good. Hygiene, personal hygiene is top tier for me. Like, top tier. So I have quite a few fragrances. But not that much. <laughs> like some of these other YouTubers. There's a lot of people in the world. But I have quite a few. Um, I'm still like buying new fragrances, seeing what I really like. So I'm kind of, um, I have different moods. It depends on my mood daily. I like sweet scents. I love vanilla. I love fresh floral scents as well. But I just love to smell sweet, like some type of sweetness. I have to be, you know, delectable. <laughs> But yeah, let's start the video. And also, I will be doing a, a haul as well because I brought some fragrances from Rebel Scents too. So yeah, we're going to start off with one of my OD beautiful fragrance that I love and I continue to buy. This is the Versace Bright Crystal. Look at the bottle. The packaging is amazing. This is a fresh scent. And this is like a scent that you wear if you just want to just go to work, go out. You can wear this going out at night. I feel like this scent come alive more in the, in the summer. Either the summer, you can wear it anytime. I wear this anytime, but I feel like it come alive more in the summer. It's beautiful. It's just a beautiful scent. I wore this the other day. I was just like, let me watch, let me wear my Versace Bright Crystal. This is it. This is what I want to wear. But yeah, packaging is amazing. Okay, I'm gonna also talk to you about the Versace Eros Perfume. I'm gonna be honest. When I first got this scent, I wasn't really like I wasn't feeling it at all. Like, I wanted to give it away to, like, one of my friends as a gift. Because I know they they probably would like it. But now, as you can see, girl, amazing. So, I wear this scent when I want to feel, like, grown and sexy. And I want to give high-end luxury. When I want to smell like money, this is the scent I pick up. If you want to smell like money, get this. This right here. Versace Eros Perfume. Get it. You got to get it. Look at it. It's, as you can tell, I use this, baby. I use it. it. Smells good. It's like, it's kind of a, I don't know. It's not fruity. It's not giving fruity. I like it. Get it. Boom. And then, that's it for my Versace's. Now let's talk about, um, this is Black Opium by YSL. So I used to wear this scent literally, religiously, every single day. This was the it scent a few years ago. Like, it used to be me. If you would have smelled me, I was wearing Black Opium YSL. It's an amazing scent, but it's, like, since I used to wear it every single day, I guess I got, like, tired of it. But I still love it. It's a good scent. Definitely smell it. You, It's like a classic. It's like something that you, you should have in your collection, Black Opium. So, let's talk about a Burberry, Burberry Brit for her. I feel like, as you can tell... There's nothing there. It's, it's almost done. I love 
this perfume. I should have brought, I should have picked up another one. This perfume is amazing. It's, I, it's kind of a complex scent. It smells like fruits. It's like a pear, a pear in a bottle. I would describe this as a pear in a bottle, but a good sweet pear. It's amazing. As you can tell, I love this scent. This is it. I feel like everybody should have at least one Burberry perfume in your collection. Just one. Amazing. I, and then the spritz. Let's look at the spritz. Look at the spritz. It's just seamless. You see how it just came out? Just still seamless. Love it. Ooh, it smells so good. <laughs> it smells so good, y'all. Go try this perfume out, please. Go pick yourself up this perfume. Now we're going to go on to Ebony Wood. Everybody know about Ebony Wood because of Kyra. Kyra put everybody on on this Ebony Wood. This is a Zara perfume. But I guess it's like from Joe Malone. It was like a collaboration with Joe Malone. And I guess he he or they made this perfume as well. But this perfume right here, when I first got it, I was just like, yeah. Yeah. This perfume, yeah. It smells really good. Like, it, sm it smells like... At first, I used to wear it every day, as you can see. I used to wear it every day, but I kind of haven't been wearing it. I haven't worn it since, like, October. Not not since October. Since, like, November. I haven't worn it since November. I haven't reached for it. But this is not something that I would recommend to wear every day because you can't get tired of it. But it does smell good. Like, it smells... It's like a sweet but sophisticated scent. It's definitely... persistent. I can't even say the word no more. This is a scent you should definitely have. And it's definitely a great price. It was like $29.90 from Zara. Amazing. And look at the body. Look at the um the body of the perfume bottle. So sleek. So nice. Just beautiful. Definitely get it. Recommend. It may be hard to find though. Let's talk about... I feel like you guys know what I'm going to say. Valentino. This right here. Look at the bottom. This scent right here. <laughs> Girl. This scent right here. Let me. Let me. I'm going to have to spray it. And I, I spray it underneath my arms. I spray it on my neck. Over here. Over here. And my stomach. This spray. Ugh, amazing. Speechless. This is an amazing scent. I love this perfume. Valentino. The Don. Donna. Donna. And I have to travel. And I also have the lotion. Yes. Big body. Big body who? Me. Of course I have it. <laughs> I got it as a gift. But I love, like, when I tell you. That's what I'm going to say. Get Go smell it. And I pair it with the, um. Solo. Brazilian body spray. Spray on me right now. Perfect combination. You walk through the store, everybody gonna be like, "Oh, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? What?" Are you... Girl, I'm wearing Valentino. Yeah, Valentino. Amazing. Like people be following me into this. Can you believe it? Like people be dead following me in the store. Like, where is the, what perfume do you have? And I literally have to search it up for them on their phone and screenshot it and give it to them because they're going to buy it. Valentino, sponsor me. 
me. <laughs> but yeah, Valentino, I love. Another perfume that I have been um, really wanting to try and I finally brought when they were having, when Huda Beauty was having her 30% off sale. I got it. This is the Kali Vanilla 28. If you go on the website right now, sold out. It's very hard to get. But look, just look at the bottle. Moment of silence. Do you see this? This is giving quality. Amazing. Vanilla 28. This perfume is amazing. I should have brought two. I should have brought two. When I ordered this beautiful fragrance, I only brought, this is the 100 ml. This is the 100 ml. So when I ordered this fragrance, I was unsure. So I was just like, let me just get this. Let me just get the 100 mil and just get one and just see how I like this fragrance. I should have got two. But now I know. Next time, guess what? I'm getting two. Because when I tell you, look at, look at how it looks. I just got this in like December or November. Look at it. I used to, I was spraying this all over. This right here, it smells so good. It's called Vanilla 28. It's, it's not really like a um vanilla bean scent. It's not really a vanilla bean scent. You know, the vanilla bean body spray from um Bath and Body Works. It's a different vanilla. It's giving high-end, top-tier vanilla, okay? You guys have to try it. it. It smells amazing. This smells amazing. Definitely get your hands. If if it gets back in stock during the sale or not on sale, please pick this up. This right here, if you, if you are a fan of vanilla, definitely get this scent. Definitely. And it comes, the packaging is just amazing. I love fragrances. I love it. I'm so happy I got my hands on this. And then I also, I also brought the, um, like the travel size one because I wanted to try, I also wanted to order the pink um, peppercorn, but I didn't want to buy a big body of that one. So I, I brought the rollerball. And it smells amazing. So next time, I'm going to get two vanillas, one pink peppercorn. And yeah, that's what I'm going to order next time it comes around. So this, um, the pink peppercorn, I think will be a great fragrance to place, to like put together with the vanilla 28. Perfect. I feel like it will go good together. So when I wear the Vanilla 28, I also use a rollerball and I put this like right here. So in the back of my ears as well. Because I think it goes perfect together. I, I really should have gotten the pink peppercorn. But I didn't know. But now I know. So next time, I will be getting it. Period. And then on the other side, they have Utopia. And... This is like a chocolate scent. It, it is like a, it just smells chocolatey. Like really chocolatey. But yeah. And then let's get into, you guys know, The Girl Gone Bad by Killian. I already did my unboxing and everything on this perfume. I love it. You guys already know how much I love it. I'm trying to get it out of the packaging right now. No. This right here. <laughs> this is definitely a acquired scent. The packaging is amazing. I'm going to link my other video um, down below of when I first unboxed it. 
it's amazing but yes this packaging this perfume right here is definitely a choir scent but Look at how I'm smiling when I smelt it. It is amazing. Definitely go smell this. I would recommend you smell it first. Don't let this be a blind buy because it's definitely an acquired scent. But I love it. Good girl, gone bad. By Killeen. So now we're going to get into the little minis that I have as well. So I have all of the Tory Burch little minis. They smell. But yeah, I got it as a gift. I got all the little minis of the Tory Burch for a gift. And they smell amazing. It's more of a fresh scent. Clean. When you want it to give off that clean kind of scent. I have these as well. And then I also have, I also wanted to smell the Gucci Flora. So I brought the Rollerball that they have at Sephora. They have it at Sephora for like, they have it at Sephora for like $39. It smells good. But the only reason why I didn't want to buy the big one is because I don't really support Gucci. Honestly, I don't. So I don't even want to like. This is the last thing I will buy Gucci. I would not be purchasing anything from Gucci. I don't support Gucci. But yeah, that's that. And then I also have this Juicy Couture little mini as well. Super cute. Look at it. It's so cute. <laughs> I love small things. So... What you guys may have been waiting for is the Rebel Scent Perfume Unboxing. So I did order quite a few, three perfumes from Rebel Scents, and they finally came in the mail. Um, one of them is a perfume that I normally purchase, which you guys will see. And two of them are two new perfumes that I'm so excited for because they smell amazing so let's go on and unbox it let me but yeah let's go and unbox it i got my handy dandy pen and we're gonna open the box so it's well packaged Okay. Hello, Rebel. This is how it comes. It comes with a card now. But yeah, it comes with a card, and then I have my receipt of purchase. And then it comes with these little thingies. You know, some of these are edible. Yeah, they're edible, some of them. But let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. So, I got Prada Candy. You guys, I love Prada candy. I have been wearing Prada candy since like middle school. This is my top tier perfume. I always go back to. This is the perfume that started my uh, perfume collection and addiction. I always go back to Prada candy. I love it. So let's open it here. I love this perfume. I'm going to show you how it looks, the bottle. Oh no, I'm going to open something else. Look at this, it's so good. Let me open the bottle. I'm going to show you guys the bottle. So it comes nicely packaged.
this right here this is what i've been waiting for once you smell me and i walk past you you must know that it's part of candy The big body of course i had to do it i always do it <laughs> let me stop but this is pot of candy it's amazing you guys have to smell it if you like gourmand sweet fragrances you would definitely love pot of candy so the packaging this is the packaging this is the bottle it's beautiful i didn't spray it but I already know how how it smells because this is I've been wearing this since like middle school. Pot of candy. I love it. It's beautiful. Something that I will always and forever repurchase is Prada of candy and also um Versace Bright Crystal. That's something that I will always repurchase. But now, oh no, and definitely my Valentino. You guys know definitely my brother <laughs> my balance you know and then i also picked up this new one that i've been wanting to get but it's always sold out on sephora but i finally got my hands on it at rebel sense so this is prada candy night and it's amazing i spelt it in um sephora loved it but this packaging is so different than the other one. I'm going to show you guys. I'm taking off the wrapping. And I don't remember how it smells, so I'm going to spray it as well. I should have definitely put some lotion on my hands. I have my pot of candy lotion as well. Let me put some on my hands because God knows my hands are dry. Not too much. A little goes a long way. Yes, I do have the lotion. And it's very moisturizing. Look. Oh, look at that. Look at that luster. You see it? Yeah. Product can't be. See that amazing but Prada candy nights you see the colors of it I don't want it to fall but it's kind of it has a gradient blue into purple into pink and then the gold detailing Prada so luxurious let's smell it again yeah this is definitely a night scent like yeah it's definitely a night scent but I love it. This is my new night scent. Definitely a night scent. If you don't want anything too sweet, definitely try this out. I definitely think you will like it. It's sweet, but not too sweet. Like the Prada Candy. Prada Candy is just like sweet. It's like a first fragrance like if you're if you're getting into the fragrance um realm and you want to try something sweet and you're like 16 years old definitely get yourself a pot of candy you will you will never go back and then i also got something that i've been wanting for a while my Burberry black eee! I finally got it eee! I 
finally got it, y'all. <laughs> I have been wanting this perfume for a while. I finally... Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so excited. Yay. I've been waiting for it to get on Rebel Sense and it finally, finally got on Rebel Sense. But now we have my Burberry Black. Oh my god. Ooh, look at it already. Already quality. Oh wow. Damn. Damn. This bottle is it. Okay. Burberry did not come to play. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this bottle. Do you see it? I know you see it. <laughs> Look at this. My Burberry Black. When I first smelled this perfume, it was like, it was probably like two years ago. But since I was buying so many other perfumes, I was just like, I'm gonna wait until next year to get it. Next year came and then I just never got it. And then, how you open it you just ah. let me spray it in the cap i spray it in the cap yeah ah! <laughs> it smells so good i think this might be my new favorite yeah ah! it smells so good i finally got it my bird very black i definitely got that mm -mm. let me stop let me stop let me stop <laughs> it smells so good y'all i wish you guys could smell it it's let me see what does it smell i can't even describe it it's kind of a fresh sweet it's so sweet because you know i love my sweetness and it's definitely a nighttime. no i will definitely wear this in the daytime too honey if i didn't just spray my valentino i would definitely be wearing this today this smells good this is giving quality this is giving top tier <laughs> this smells so good y'all my burberry black Definitely check this out. Definitely check this out. On Rebel Sense, they have it for. Let me see. Let me see how much I pay for it. Always oh, not here how much I paid for it, but in total for all three perfumes, I got a steal. I only paid one hundred and sixty nine dollars on Rebel Sense. Yes, for all three, all three perfumes. For my product candy, my my Burberry, my Burberry Black only spent one hundred and sixty nine dollars. Yep, I did. Right here. So check out Rebel Scents. Look, I got all these perfumes. Come on now, yeah. This one perfume on like Macy's is like a hundred and something dollars for this ounce, which is the 2.7 fluent ounce. You can't beat it. You can't beat it. This other perfume is um, the same fluid ounce, 2.75. This will probably be a hundred and something dollars too. And then my Burry Burry Black is probably like a hundred and thirty something dollars. So I definitely... I definitely got a good discount. Check out Rebel Sense, you guys. I'm going to have a link below. And thank you guys for coming back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to like and subscribe. And comment below. Like, comment below, interact with me. And also, I do have an Instagram channel. And it's called It's underscore underscore alicia underscore underscore but thank you guys for coming back and liking and subscribing 
and staying with me. <laughs> Love you guys. This year is going to be a great year. I'm going to be putting out more content when i can but i will be definitely posting i love you guys thank you guys for the love and support and yeah happy new year Mwah.